What up, folks? I am UltraZilla, and today I have a review of the Good Smile Company Dynazenon Kaiju Gagula. That's right, my zillions. This is a soft vinyl figure of the Gagula. First form, I believe. Um, this is really cool. Nicely painted vinyl figure that was definitely way too expensive it's supposed to go with the motoroid version the model kit version of dinosaur i never got that and i'm trying i haven't been building any models lately but i really wanted this kaiju you could go with my grid man and hopefully one day they will make a properly sized dinosaur figure I, one can hope right cool box but gigantic box which cost way too much to ship unfortunately is what it is but without any further ado let's get to the rig so here's this big guy Jew, right out of the box and uh, he does have a, a tag uh, which is cool so on top of the box he has a tag with the animation piece uh there which looks nice back absolutely nothing on the tag but you know you, you do get a tag here and articulation on this big vinyl figure you have shoulder movements you have a leg movements you have waist movement which is cool and uh then you got tail movement there and tail movement uh, there so you do get one, a uh, two, a three, a four, a five, a six, a seven points of articulation on it, which is which is good. Taking a look at Gagula in full, it is really, really, really nice. I honestly love it, and I'm glad I do because again, shipping was crazy on this, and the price itself was pretty pricey. So you got a nice gold tip of the tail, which looks great. Blue kind of purplish blue uh and white off-white is kind of the theme here and it looks awesome love this tail really nice love these little like vents here all the kaiju in dinosaur are kind of biomechanical which is pretty cool great great tail i like it paint looks choppy along the tail though but eh, for some reason i don't hate it because you're looking at it like this and don't really see it like that but really nice sculpt that is for sure it goes up to this piece which looks good i do like that and then uh this you know it's like an under armor right uh and it looks really good and then the legs you can see the you know white parts the other armor pieces above that and you got some gold pieces which look amazing too love the spikes on the knee love the claws love these little circular ones i like it a lot it's pretty nice looking really nice looking legs going up the krajiji here into the chest really nice sculpt again you got gold here which looks good and if you can tell there's uh, like a little bit of a dark wash on this guy and that's good uh looks really good here here some nice little highlights for shading up here makes it nice and gray and dirty looking really like these uh shoulder pads by the way you got gold in here again which looks really good that bluish purplish what do you call that color guys <laughs> Uh, but it looks good. It's mostly, I'm, I'm going to say more purplish. Uh, but I like all the little spikes here and on the claws, kind of like Wolverine claws coming out. Hands look pretty good overall. Again, the chest looks really nice. I like the gold there. I like how this is kind of separated here. Then going up the neck, you can see it's shaded there as well, which is very cool. The... Uh, gold here looks great going up to the, the head sculpt i like it I like his red eyes you see his mouth there wish there was a little shading in that part that would have been cool so you could see this mouth a little bit better but the horn is really nice and you got these interesting looking 
uh, dorsal fins. Very, very different. Very nicely done. I like those. This is kind of like some like hair tube type of deal. Uh, and then you got this giant energy um, dorsal fin thing. This looks incredible. I love the green. I love the sparkliness in it. Really nice sculpt. That's tremendous, guys. That's really, really nice. I think this is what made this figure cost more. Uh, is uh, That is something you don't normally find on these, like, Sofubi, the movie monster S Sofubi. It's more like kind of a DX Ultra Monster. I liken it to that. Um, but I think more paint on this guy. Um, I, I think so. A little more articulation like I, you saw in the tail. So, um, yeah, I, I think it's really good looking. And it's nice, big, chunky guy. I like the proportions a lot. This is a heck of a kaiju, guys. It really is. I, th I think it's really, really well done. Pricey, but well done. And for your size comparisons, here's a Gagula with a bunch of other Subaraya figures you might have in your collection. This is the Figma. This is the Ultra Act original Gridman. Uh, and this is the Takara Tomy Diaclone Gridman, which I, I actually like the size better uh on uh i just I, th I just think it's nicer looking um size wise he's a little bit smaller and it just makes gagula look more grandiose i don't know something about it just it works for me i don't know maybe it doesn't work for you kind of works for me and my final thoughts i really like it i think it's a really nice piece some of the paint is a little choppy like along the tail but it's not that bad uh, and it's really where that purple meets the white. Um, otherwise, it's really, really good looking. That gold really pops all over the place. That back green translucent plastic thing is amazing as well. Um, really like it. Uh, so yeah, this is a good piece. It really, really is. Again, you know, it was a little pricey and even pricier to ship. Uh, for what it is, um, but that box was tremendous, and I wish they did it a different way. He does have a really, really long tail, so uh, uh, it's kind of annoying. It is what it is, though. I got it. I wanted it, and um, you know, he's part of the Gridman universe, so he's definitely going to go with my Figma. Like I said, I hope they do a Dino Zen on in the scale, like a Robot Spirits or something uh, along those lines. Um, I know Figma's doing all this stuff, but it would be nice to have something you didn't have to build. Can you do that, Good Smile? Can you do that? That's not the giant DX, which I already have. Anywho, that's my review. Really nice kaiju. Hope you dug it. Let me know your thoughts down below. And please like, comment, subscribe, and share. Check me out on Facebook and Instagram. Stay safe. Till next time. Peace out, people.